Hello everyone and welcome to Groovy Sauce and today I'm going to be checking out soft sticks. Now these are cheese filled soft pretzel sticks. These just so happen to be their cheddar version. Now I absolutely love bread sticks and cheese snacks so these certainly seem like the bready cheesy snack that I would really enjoy. Let's go ahead and pop them in the microwave and see what I think. All right, everybody, I got a bunch of them here hot out of the microwave, and you get 10 per package. That's a pretty small package, but each one looks like this. They look like they've been already pre-cooked before you even put them into the microwave, so there's no need to, like, cook any dough or anything. They smell really good, too. You can definitely smell both the pretzel and the cheddar there, so I think the only thing left to do now is just to give it a taste, so let's go ahead and do that. Mmm. Mmm. You know what this reminds me of? The pretzel and cheddar dip if you've ever been to Annie Ann's. I used to absolutely love eating their cheddar dip with a hot, fresh pretzel, and this is exactly what that tastes like. Mmm. All you people who've ever ate at Annie Ann's should absolutely know what I'm talking about. Really great. The, the cheddar dip like filling here is spot on for the cheddar dip that you actually get at Annie Ann's. So kudos, this is just perfect in terms of like the cheddar flavor for me. Even the pretzel flavor, really good. The only thing that I think that they're missing here with these pretzels is maybe the addition of some of that pretzel salt because what I'm seeing here, all these bites don't really have any salt. Maybe I got one specifically without the salt. But otherwise, it's pretty spot on to the Annie Ann's cheddar dip pretzel. The pretzel flavors by themselves, too, really great. I think they nailed the dough. The flavor of the pretzel is absolutely perfect, besides the salt. Let me go ahead and get another bite here. Mmm. I'm serious about that cheddar sauce, too. There's the inside. It's not solid or anything. It tastes almost exactly like that dip. Consistency. Think of kind of like a cheese dip, not an actual like hard cheese or even a string cheese or even like a liquid cheese. It's, it's more of like a cheese dip inside there. There's nothing in terms of like jalapenos or anything inside there either. Just a straight up delicious cheddar sauce and a delicious pretzel exterior. All right, so I think that I pretty much nailed pretty much all the uh, points here. One more bite, we'll get to my final thoughts. All right, everybody, so the soft sticks, cheddar-filled soft pretzel bites, I thought were actually really great. I used to work at Annie Ann's, so this is a huge surprise to me that they were able to nail the flavors so perfectly in terms of replicating that cheddar sauce and the actual genuine pretzel flavor. Like I said previously, I think the only thing that's actually missing here is that salty exterior on top of the pretzels. Otherwise, everything here is a home run. I think that if you like cheddar and pretzels, you're absolutely going to love this because nothing here tastes subpar in either of those departments. Uh, if you're just looking for a pretzel cheddar snack, this is definitely a very high quality one that I most definitely would get behind and tell you to check out. Uh, yeah. I do think if they did add the salt, though, it would make it absolutely perfect. So if you're if you're looking at videos out there, soft sticks, uh, yeah, make sure to maybe consider putting some salt on there. Or maybe I just didn't get one that specifically uh, was noted as having salt. Either way, very good product. Absolutely love it. Check it out, all you pretzel and Annie Ann's cheddar pretzel fans. This seems like a perfect at-home version of that. And I think that's all that really needs to be said here. Make sure that you give me a like if you like the video, as well as subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more content from me. I don't always do food reviews. Sometimes I also do video game gameplay and just about anything else I feel like doing whenever I have the free time. So with that being said, thank you all very much for watching and hopefully I will see you next time.